is the real reason we tell stories, and how can you use it to make yours better? Well, the answer to that question can be found in your next Daily Dose of Public Speaking Wisdom. In my speaking and coaching career, I've been fortunate to have some of the best speech coaches and storytelling coaches in the world. One of those people is a man named Michael Hay. Michael is a former Hollywood scriptwriting consultant, very highly sought. He worked with A-list uh, actors like Will Smith and Reese Witherspoon. So he's got a track record. He's got a solid reputation. Michael has taught me a lot about storytelling, and this is one of the most important lessons. One day he said, Mike, storytelling boils down to this. The purpose of a good story is to elicit emotion. That's it. If your story doesn't elicit any kind of emotion, then why tell it? People aren't going to react to it. Now, in the movies, this can be one of great adventure. You can make people happy, sad, frustrated. All kinds of emotions can be generated. What about business stories? Do they have to generate emotion? Absolutely. A good business story typically creates a feeling of hope in others. You've heard this before in previous videos, but the purpose of a good story, a good speech, is to give people hope. For example, in my speeches about public speaking and, and business storytelling, I give people hope that they can overcome their anxiety and become confident speakers who deliver a clear and compelling message. When I was a financial advisor, I gave people hope that they could educate their kids, they could have a secure retirement. I did that through storytelling. As you create your next story, start with this idea in mind. The purpose of the story is to elicit emotion. Think about what emotion you want to create in people or elicit in others. Is it hope? Is it joy or, or happiness? Maybe it's an entertaining speech. If it's an informative speech, you can allay concerns or fears that people have. There are all kinds of emotions you can generate, but that's the starting point with your story. What emotion can you generate? We'll talk to you tomorrow in our next Daily Dose of Public Speaking Wisdom.